Hello everyone, my name is Allison Burton and I'm the programmer for the North Adams Library. Now, our theme for today is Halloween. So, I'm going to start with a rhyme called Skeleton Parade by Jack Prelutsky. The skeletons are out tonight. They march about the street with bony bodies, bony heads, and bony hands and feet. Bony, bony, bony bones with nothing in between. Up and down and all around, they march on Halloween. Now, our first book for today is Halloween Hustle, written by Charlotte Gnufson, illustrated by Kevin J. Atterbury, and published by Two Lions. Copyright 2013. In the dark, a funky beat. Something white with bony feet. Skeleton dancing up the street, doing the Halloween hustle. Bony thumbs and fingers snap. Bony heels and toes tip-tap, knees knock-knock, and elbows flap, doing the Halloween hustle. Skeleton twists his skinny hips, shakes his shoulders, skates and skips. On a crooked crack, he trips. Bones scatter, what a clatter. Spine is like a broken ladder. He sticks his bones back into place. Adds rubber bands just in case. Gets up and grooves with ghoulish grace. Doing the Halloween hustle. He swings around the bus stop sign. Once, twice, then gets in line, right behind Frankenstein, doing the Halloween hustle. Climbs on the bust, can't find a seat. That's okay, he finds the beat. Shuffles and scuffles those bony feet, doing the Halloween hustle. The big bus zigzags through the town, zooms up hills, then cruises down. Every monster for miles around is doing the Halloween hustle. The bus slows down and then it stops. Skeleton leaves with three high hops, leads the others to the shops, doing the Halloween hustle. Skeleton buys a snazzy hat, a jazzy jacket to go with that. But in his path, a big black cat. Bones scatter, what a clatter. Spine is like a broken ladder. Skeleton doesn't groan or whine. Binds his bones with tape and twine. He bounces up, feeling fine, doing the Halloween hustle. In fancy clothes, the monsters go to the party in a row. A funky, freaky fashion show doing the Halloween hustle. The ghostly host greets each guest. How do you do? You're so well dressed. Just in time for the dance contest, doing the Halloween hustle. Monsters move on through the door, 
jump and jive out on the floor. Spooky judges hold up scores for doing the Halloween hustle. Skeleton shimmies, swings, and sways, bebops as the music plays. But Zombie's foot gets in the way. Bones scatter. What a clatter. Spine is like a broken ladder. A skeleton girl with a friendly smile sweeps the bones up in a pile. Skeleton, hey, in just a while, you'll do the Halloween hustle. She uses a bottle of super strong glue. You're fixed forever. You're just like new. Hey, I'd like to dance with you. Let's do the Halloween hustle. All the monsters cheer and clap. Bony thumbs and fingers snap. Bony heels and toes tip tap. Doing the Halloween hustle. The end. Now, our second book for today is The Twelve Days of Halloween, written by Jenna Lettis, illustrated by Colleen Madden, and published by Random House, copyright 2017. On the first day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? One very eager trick-or-treater. Trick-or-treat! You're a little early, son. On the second day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Two stuffed scarecrows and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the third day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the fourth day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Four scary costumes, three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the fifth day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Five bags of candy, four scary costumes, three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the sixth day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Six ghosts a-spooking, five bags of candy, four scary costumes, three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the seventh day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Seven spiders crawling, six ghosts a-spooking, five bags of candy, four scary costumes, three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the eighth day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Eight black cats hissing, seven spiders crawling, six ghosts a-spooking, five bags of candy, four scary costumes, three jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and 
one very eager trick-or-treater. Can I keep them? On the ninth day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? Nine witches cackling. Eight black cats hissing. Seven spiders crawling. Six ghosts a spooking. Five bags of candy. Four scary costumes. Three jack o' lanterns. Two stuffed scarecrows. And one very eager trick or treater. Have you seen our cats? Eight kittens, you can't miss them. Meow? My kitty loves cheese fishies. Hey, where's my kitty? Oh, Mr. Cuddles. Okay, where are they? On the 10th day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? 10 werewolves howling. Nine witches cackling. Eight black cats hissing. Seven spiders crawling. Six ghosts a spooking. Five bags of candy. Four scary costumes. Three jack-o'-lanterns. Two stuffed scarecrows. And one very eager trick-or-treater. On the 11th day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? 11 vampires grinning, 10 werewolves howling, 9 witches cackling, 8 black cats hissing, 7 spiders crawling, 6 ghosts a spooking, 5 bags of candy, 4 scary costumes, 3 jack-o'-lanterns, two stuffed scarecrows, and one very eager trick-or-treater. On the 12th day of Halloween, what showed up at our door? 12 devils plotting, 11 vampires grinning, 10 werewolves howling, 9 witches cackling, Eight black cats hissing. Seven spiders crawling. Six ghosts a spooking. Five bags of candy. Four scary costumes. Three jack-o'-lanterns. Two stuffed scarecrows. And one very eager trick-or-treater. Happy Halloween! The end. Now, a craft you can make to go along with these books is a skeleton bones ripped paper craft, like this. So, the first thing you'll need is a piece of black construction paper. Then, you'll take a piece of white chalk and trace the outline of your hand on the black paper. Next, you'll need a piece of white paper to tear into different sized rectangles. Then you'll take a glue stick and glue the white pieces of paper all in your hand outline. That way they look like bones. Then you have made your very own Skeleton Bones Ripped Paper Craft. Also, another Halloween themed book you can read is Haley's Halloween by Lisa Bullard, which you can access using your library card and pen on Hoopla Digital. The links to each of these can be found in this video's description. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day and stay healthy.